hi guys i hope you're doing well so as i mentioned in my last video this week i want to tackle some interview questions that i feel um candidates struggle with and they end up missing out on opportunities because they don't know how to uh, navigate these questions so the other question i want us to talk about is the the very last question they normally ask do you have any questions for us and my goodness the questions that we hear are you know some you know some of the questions we hear are completely completely ridiculous there are instances where uh, where people have actually missed job offers because of the kind of questions they, they ask you know at the end through the interview you know you answer so well and you are uh, you're saying all the right things and then when it comes to um do you have any questions for us you just ask something that just throws everyone off and you end up missing um an offer so what is the best way to tackle uh, uh, this question? The first thing I want to say is remember how you begin the interview is very important because of course first impressions are very important. Uh, but also how you end. So the last impression that you leave on the interviewers is also very important because this is the very last thing that they're going to remember um, you by. So you want to make sure that you, you ask them good questions. I don't know if you've been in, um, you, you've gone for an interview and then the person who's gone ahead of you, you can just hear them laughing and talking for hours and hours. And then you go in and you are just there for 20 minutes and the interview is done and you wonder, you know, like what happened. What happened is those guys knew what kind of questions to ask. They, you know, they were able to break the ice and just, you know, have a conversation with the interviewers. And that's what you want to do. You want to ask good questions. You want to ask intelli uh, intelligent questions. You don't want to, uh, to, to waste that opportunity to ask things like, do we have potluck on Thursday? Do we dress down on Saturdays? Uh, do we work during public holidays? Those are not good questions to ask, you know, about the perks of the jobs. Because once you get the offer, you have an opportunity to, to ask, you know, everything about the culture of the organization and how much the pay is and about the leave days and all those things. You'll have another chance to ask those questions. Always remember when you're going for an interview, the purpose of the interview is to land you the offer. So get the offer first. Do everything, you, you know, you can and everything in your power to get the offer first. Once you get the offer, you can ask all those other questions later. So use this time to ask questions that will help you get the offer. And what kind of questions are going to help you get the offer? Questions like, um, you know, for this position that you're hiring me for, uh, what does success look like? How will you measure success? Um, you know, like um, what challenges, uh, you know, did the person who was in this uh, role uh, face and what kind of challenges do you foresee that I'm going to? Uh, to face in this position is this position a new position or is it a backfill um ask you know ask questions that are directly related to uh you know like to this particular position and the only way to ask good questions is if you have read the uh, the jd and internalized the jd done your research about the company then you'll be able to ask you know good questions you'll be able to ask intelligent questions um don't ask anything about the pay at this point because as i mentioned once you get the offer you'll have a chance for you to uh to negotiate so you can you can be able to ask everything that you need to ask at that at that particular point but at this point you just want to find out you know like are you a good fit for uh, uh for the role um you can even ask them things like for someone to be successful in this role like what are some of the things that they need to have then when you when you ask such kind of of questions you know the the, the interview is going to open up and then you know you guys you're going to start having a conversation and this is a perfect and excellent way to end so think about the kind of questions that, uh, that you want to ask ask good questions ask questions about the you know that are directly about the job and you know like what your contribution would be um don't ask them you know like uh, how did you guys think i did during the interview like what i mean how can you ask them that like like what if you did poorly of course they're not going to tell you that you did very poorly uh and they're not going to hire you so ask intelligent questions ask questions that we leave a lasting impression on the interviewer and i can guarantee you if you do that even if probably you are done very poorly uh like the the the, the, uh, the first questions maybe you know like you'd ask very good questions and they might have you know like a change of heart and decide to like you know hire you or just uh just like have you as one of the best candidates for that position so that's all that i, ha that I had for today i hope this video has been uh beneficial thank you and see you next time